So first, I want to congratulate the United Arab Emirates, and particularly His Excellency Sultan Al Jabbar, for putting together a fantastic COP. Coming from the World Bank and being the Global Director for Environment, what makes me so excited being here these past two weeks are two things. First, the discussion on climate finance, which often gets stuck at other COPs talking about we need more money. But what, we, what the Sultan and what UAE has helped us have a conversation about is how do we use the money better? How do we make sure that poor countries and poor communities in every country have better access and the money has better impact? So having a conversation around climate finance that isn't just about putting more money on the table, but how to use the money that's there to have greater impact has made a huge difference. The second thing that makes us really happy is how much nature is part of the conversation. We all know that when it comes to climate change, if we want to bend the curve of emissions to zero, we can't do it without the world's forests, without the world's ocean. And the UAE has brought that conversation to the heart of COP, something that's never been done before. So one of the solutions that we're very excited about are nature-based solutions. The reason we're excited is for many poor communities in places like Sub-Saharan Africa, South Asia, the only climate technology that's affordable, the only climate technology they'll have access to are nature-based solutions. Figuring out how to use better channeling of their rivers using nature-based solutions so they can have better access to water, manage water resources at a time when we we know climate change is a story of water. There's too much of it, there's too little of it. So nature-based solutions are something we think are going to be more and more part of the conversation around climate solutions.